The Lakes High School football team had a successful 2015 season, thanks in part to an assistant coach who played for the Lancers, the Huskies, and the Seahawks. Still, there is a shakeup that has nothing to do with football fields. And as Cairo 7's Amy Clancy learned, it has everything to do with grass. One of the most popular and successful football coaches the Lakes Lancers have ever had has been told he is not welcome back next year. Not because of any problem on the field, but because of what he does for a living. We will be offering the premium cannabis experiences for Washington State. Hillary Butler is excited about his new business as a soon-to-be licensed Tier 3 cannabis producer and processor. He and his partners will break ground on a 30,000 square foot growing site on Monday. But he told Cairo 7 his legal marijuana plans have ended. <laughs> his two-year run as Lakes High School's assistant football coach. And it really hit me hard. I actually broke down and started crying. We made it third in the state last year after going a couple of years without even making it in the playoffs. So I do think I contributed to the school, and I do think that I still can. Butler, who played for the Lancers, the Huskies, and the Seahawks, doesn't blame the coach at Lakes, whom he admires and supports, but said the decision was made by the Clover Park School District. Its spokesperson gave no reason for Butler's termination, but in a statement claimed coaching adjustments are made regularly depending on the needs of the team and best interest of student athletes. No reference at all to pot. Butler fears others in the legal pot industry who work with kids may face similar scrutiny. And we're at the cutting edge of a great industry, and I'm proud to be on the forefront of it. Butler is still hopeful the district will reconsider and that he will be back in the locker room in the fall. Reporting in Lakewood, Amy Clancy, Cairo 7 News. And Butler told us that he will miss the players the most, but he won't give up what will likely be a lucrative business in order to coach for $6,000 a year. As he told us, he has his own family to support.